future for whatever reason. We're going to have a payment that happens not today, but at some point in the future. Whatever the stated rate is for that payment, whatever the stated amount is, we need to basically bring it back to the current day, to the current dollars. And so what we want to do is present value then that single amount of the payment. And you can imagine this kind of happening in a, in a revenue planning type of thing as well. So if we make a certain investment, we're going to receive some, some revenue in the future that we would have to assume that would happen in the future. And then uh, present value that back into the current dollars once again to make our, our decision making process to see if it would be a relevant uh, thing to do. Now, these are the single amounts and we have to keep in mind the single